guys, welcome back to Windsor Live. My name is Gabby. And I'm Beatrice. Today is all about layering. So we're going to show you six blank canvas looks and style them at least three different ways with fall layers. It's going to be so fun. <laughs> all right, let's dive into my outfit. Um, first of all, I have an amazing co-host with me here today. This is Beatrice Adriana. Hi, thanks for having me. Yeah, guys, so exciting. She has some awesome style, showcases it all over Instagram and beyond, and I think you guys are going to fall in love with it. So definitely stay tuned. We're going to hear a lot more from Beatrice and some of her amazing picks for today. But let's dive into some of these looks. So first up is the dress I'm wearing right here. This is our daring button up midi dress. So I definitely wanted to do a plain black look so we can put a couple different jackets on this. This is such a trending dress right now with this collar neckline, the button up front, and this one's super unique because it's got these dual waist cutouts on the side. So it's kind of like that city girl chic professional look, but then it's a little bit sexy with these cutouts. What do you think? Oh, I love it. It's like sexy, it's effortless, um, and I love how you paired it with this funnel. Yeah, exactly. It kind of gives it um, some casualness to it. Yes, yeah, so this is going to be a long sleeve dress, so I'll kind of just show you guys like that before we get into the jacket. But super cute. I love the midi length too. It really just like kind of elongates you. It's super professional, like super cute. And can we talk about your boots? Like they yes. look so good with this dress. I love the chain. Thank they just you. fit perfectly. Yeah, I definitely want to do an all black. I think that's just classic. You can't go wrong with no. that, right? Can't go wrong. Um, so for the jacket, this is going to be our Cozy Vibes plaid jacket. Got that awesome plaid print. It's kind of like a cropped hem, so it comes right at my hips, I would say, um, which pairs really well with the tight dress because it's kind of just your oversized boxy look, which is really in style for fall, of course. Um, it's a woven fabric, pretty thick, gonna have that relaxed fit, and this is just gonna be really cozy to throw over a dress like this and maybe go out for date night. Yeah, you look date night ready. You're ready to go. <laughs> I just need to find a date. <laughs> um, okay, so those boots that you were loving that we talked about, these are these stylish and edgy chain link boots, and these are a little bit elevated. So I know um, that you love to elevate your style, and I think this is a great example of that because you could just do plain black booties with this, or you could get the ones here at Windsor that have this edgy chain link over the top of it. It just adds a little bit of sparkle, kind of um, like a little bit of jewelry. It almost looks like an anklet, right? Yeah. I just love that they look very edgy and that's, you know, sort of my style. I have a little edge to my style. Um, I think we all have a little edge <laughs> to us that we can't deny. So, you know, these are Yeah, so definitely. Good. So, um, before we move on, I just want to ask you, Beatrice, you're definitely into fashion, have been for a while. Tell us yeah. a little bit about um, you know, when you started posting on Instagram, when you started seeing that everyone was really relating to your style? Well, I started in 2015, I want to say 2015. Um, that's like, I'm bad with math. That's already about <laughs> six, seven years. Yeah. Um, but yeah, but even before that, um, I was always into documenting my outfits. Like I used to take photos of my outfit with my Polaroid camera and yeah. I would put them in my albums and I was just obsessed with taking photos of my outfits and I don't know why this is before Instagram yeah but obviously Instagram came along and it was just perfect it just came natural to me and um, yeah just started documenting and being consistent with it I love yeah. that you have a Polaroid camera <laughs> yeah and I still have a Polaroid camera but obviously I don't take photos of my outfits <laughs> now but I used to do that and I have a whole album of my outfits Oh, that yeah. is so cute. <laughs> that is something so nice to have, and it's probably really fun to see how your style has evolved from back in oh, those days. Oh, it's evolved. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> love, that. yeah. <laughs> love that. And I feel like everything retro is coming back now. So, like, yeah. people look at how to get the Polaroids just for fun now, or, like, they really tap into those, like, 90s styles. Oh, yeah. Are you a big fan of that retro style? I am. I mean, I feel like this is kind of 90s with, you know, anything flannel, uh, you know, it, it kind of gives me 90s vibes, but it's also just very fall. Um, I just feel like it doesn't get any more fall than wearing flannel or plaid. And yeah, I just love this whole set that I'm wearing. So um, cool. we're going to get to that yeah. um, in just a second. Let's see, we have some commenters. Uh, Jenna Lisa says, please restock the hookup faux leather core set top before Halloween. Well, we love to see that you are shopping at Windsor and looking forward to some of our awesome stuff. I've definitely tried that corset top on before and it is so good so I really hope we restock soon if you haven't already 
um, signed up for our waitlist on the website, definitely put your email in. So as soon as it's back in stock in your size, we can let you know. And that's the best way to get your Windsor items that you're looking for. Hope that helps. If you guys are tuning in right now, you have any comments or questions, please leave them down below. Uh, we can help you with your styling, let us know what you love from today's live, and all of that fun stuff. So here's the second look with this dress. Ooh, let me know what you that think. That is nice. <laughs> I love that. This is definitely kind of like more glamorous vibes. This is our stylishly spotted leopard print duster. It's kind of got a really long hem, so it comes even longer than my midi dress. And it's kind of like a thick sweater material with a little bit of distressing all the way around it. So super casual. You even got the pockets right there. It kind of like makes this even more cozy and casual. Yeah. Um, what do you think? I love it. It's. I mean, I love anything leopard print. Um, yeah. This is just like it does add. It make it makes it look a little bit more cozier than I. I would say the the crop flannel. Yeah. Um. But yeah. I mean, it's just it goes nice. Like the dimensions. The it's pretty length. much like wearing a blanket. <laughs> so <laughs> if you're going out, you know, to a nice dinner, you can kind of throw this on while you're walking around the city when it's nice and cold, and you can kind of just take it off and have. The dress speak for itself but again love the animal prints i think cheetah is always in style year round right yeah, yeah that's true <laughs> you can let out your wild side a little bit with some of the cheetah prints we're going to be talking about <laughs> okay next up i just want to throw on a little bag to show you guys what that might look like if you want to complete the look this is our night to remember croc top handle crossbody so cute so you could wear it with a chain perfect. You could just hold it if you wanted to. A bunch of different options here. I think the small size bag is really in style right now. I love small bags. Yeah. Like the, I mean, I think at least for me because I'm shorter, I think it just suits me more than yeah. like a big oversized bag. But yeah, that's perfect. Yeah, this is like very nineties. The crop yeah. print, the small little bag that you hold like up here, like definitely in style right now. I'll just come up and show you guys up close, really quick. Great bag, great price. So cute. And I love this because the chain details match the ones in my shoes. And then also with my necklace right here, this is the Lux Layered three pack necklace set. It's got three separate necklaces, different chain sizes, which is great. And then it comes with these little gold ball stud earrings as well. So you're just fully put together. You just have to buy a couple things you put together. from Windsor and you're fully put together. All the chains match. It's just so cute. All right, next up. Let's talk about your outfit now. So cute. Yeah. We've been getting a little bit of a sneak peek, but um, tell us a little bit more about why you chose this outfit. What was your inspiration? So I chose this outfit because I love that it already came as a set. Um, you didn't have to like think too much about it. I have those days where I just don't want to put too much thought into it, and it just comes already as a set for you. Um, and for me, I'm kind of I love anything oversized, and I love that this is oversized, and it comes with a mini skirt to go with it and I just paired it with this basic white top and these boots which are very comfortable um they're soft boots and I don't know I just I feel like I can walk for hours in these and I just the bone color is the beige is what caught my eye um I just think it just ties in all together the neutral tone Yes, I absolutely love that. I think matching sets are totally in right now. And this yeah. is super unique. I don't think I've seen a matching mini skirt in a yeah. flannel before. That's what caught my eye. I thought it was really unique. When I saw this, I was like, okay, I'm like, I, I, I just, I, I had to stick with this. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's different. I haven't seen that, like the matching flannel flag. Yeah, yeah definitely. So you say you love oversized. Do you yeah. think like comfy, casual is like really a part of your wardrobe? Yeah, definitely. I'm, I would describe my style as everyday basic but elevated. Um, I like to mix in highs and lows, like wear a $40 dress with a nice nice luxury bag or vice versa. Um, yeah, I'm just, you know, I'm all about casual and comfort, um, but, you know, and a little edge. Definitely yeah. a, little, a little edge. <laughs> I have a little edge. I love too. that so much. I feel like that's really relatable, right? Like just kind of mixing those um, you know, affordable brands with the high end ones, yeah. so you feel a little bit fancy sometimes. I love that. I'm all definitely a super comfy, casual girl, too. I'm like the one Windsor host who always um, wears the comfortable shoes and like chooses that here, and everyone else is wearing like the high stilettos. And I'm like, guys, I just want to be comfy. <laughs> so that really reflects my style, too. I can definitely relate to you with that. 
so if you guys are just tuning in right now, we're talking about fall layering, which is so much fun. If you want to see all of these items and more on our website, you can just head to windsorstore.com. All you have to do is click the link in this post, and that's going to take you right there to all the uh, items. And you guys have almost 300 stores? Yes, that's we do. We are right about there at 300 stores across the U.S., which is insane, so amazing. Wow. So if you haven't visited a Windsor store yet, there's got to be one close to you, so go check it out. You can try on this stuff for yourself, too. Okay, next up, we've got another outfit pick from you. Yes, let's grab that one. Starting with the bodysuit, if you want to tell them about yeah, that. Yeah, so I went with this look because I, I'm, I'm made with date nights. Um, I probably have date night like once a week, and this just screamed date night for me. I love this mesh bodysuit. Let me get closer so you guys can look at the mesh detail and I love the, the V neck knot, neckline. It's very sexy and chic um, and I would pair it with a pair of denim jeans because again I like to incorporate some casual to my outfit so it's elevated but still casual. Um, yeah, they're a little grungy but cool and I would pair this with, um, layer it with this denim, I mean sorry denim, this fake leather jacket. It comes with different zippers can see there it's nice and smooth and it's cropped so I think this would look perfect with this um, it's a little edgy and yeah I think it just goes ties in really nice together so cute I love the edginess that you wanted to add with it definitely can see that with the ripped jeans the full leather jacket um, and then with this bodysuit this is super versatile so you could do yeah. this with so many different things you could pair it with like a little cute tight mini skirt and then go from a, a more fancy look yeah, even like maybe a like vegan leather skirt yeah um, i think yeah you can definitely wear it different ways um and these I, are just essential pieces that you need in your wardrobe right oh <laughs> yeah for sure you need to have your fake leather jacket and you know just like a simple basic black top that's sexy and chic and of course a good pair of denim jeans I absolutely love that. So let's talk about what shoes you would pair it with then as well, if you want to show them those. Yeah, so I would pair it with this heel. It's a nice chocolate brown color, and it has straps that you can you know, strap to your ankle. Um, I just think it's really sexy with an open toe. Um, and then, I don't know, I kind of like mixing chocolate brown colors with black. Um, I think it goes really nice together. So cute. And you look put together for day night, so. Yeah, definitely. Good. I love that you added the brown in there because it just makes it like kind of more perfect for fall. You could do the yeah. all black, but throwing some brown in there really makes it fall. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay, um, let's grab a different jacket to throw over that for like a completely different look. Just like gonna hold that one. So this is another um, jacket I would opt for if I wanted to do something a little more. Uh, laid back, um, but the colors still go really nice together. And with the brown heel, you kind of again you have kind of like the hints of brown with the beige. Um, I think the colors just tie in very effortless, and you look put together. Um, and I love that this is kind of longer, um, and the I, I love that the material is like very smooth. It's like a smooth suede, if you guys can see there. And I love the buttons. So cute. So cute. I really love that too. We can definitely see that your your style is very like elevated neutrals. That's kind of what. Yeah, I do <laughs> like neutrals, but I also love popping in some some colors. Um, I have my favorite pops of colors that I like to incorporate. Okay. Yes. What are those? What are like, some um, of your favorite colors? I would say pink, greens. Um, you know, I think it just suits me. My you know my color. Yeah. Um, I think. Uh, what else? Yeah, definitely pinks, greens, browns, um, yellows. Okay. Even. Yeah. 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 I'm feeling super extra bold. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, for sure. I love that. Um, so I know you have a couple of accessories here as well. Do you want to talk about this wonderful bag to okay. pair? This, this bag I'm really excited about because I, I saw this on their online shop and um, when I just like seen it in person, the quality is like ten times even better. You guys can see there, it comes with a nice chain, and it also has a longer strap. I love this bag, um, and it's a perfect size. I would pair this with this. Um, kind of gives it like a nice little edge, and it just, just, it just, it's so seamless. 
so cute. I'm obsessed with this bag. <laughs> it's obsessed. <laughs> I think you absolutely need that bag for your wardrobe. Yeah. I mean, it could be a designer bag. Who knows, it right? Can. It yeah. definitely has that high quality look it to has it. Nice quality. Yeah. And it adds some texture. I love that bag because it adds some texture to your outfit, which is great. Yeah. Here's um, a necklace that you picked out as well. If you want to show Thank that you. one. I love this necklace because it already comes layered for you. Um, I just, for me, it just it makes the job easier for me. Like instead of having to put like five different necklaces on, it's already nicely layered. So I think this would be perfect. And of course, I love gold. So this would complete the look. Oh, well, are you like a gold girl? All your I am. Is gonna be gold? Oh yeah, yeah, I am. <laughs> I was always more of a silver girl, but I think. Now I've been kind of leaning into the gold more, especially for fall. I think yeah. fall is like the color. Yeah, I just, I mean, even my, my wedding ring engagement ring are gold. So oh, just, okay. I love gold. Yeah, I just love that. Okay, here's some belts here I'll trade you. So these belts, again, I love the chain and I love that they just look edgy. It comes in brown and black. Um, yeah, I just think this is something I would wear with like throw on with my jeans just to make it give it more of an edge and with the black bodysuit I think it would look perfect so cute it would definitely elevate your look I normally yeah. do jeans without a belt but it's just like that one extra step of taking your outfit to the next level right yeah it's fun yeah okay okay lastly we have this super cute hat you have to try it on <laughs> okay <laughs> What do you think? Oh my gosh, I love that. Oops. Even with that outfit, it's so cute. Yeah, I mean, this hat is fun. I would wear this with just a simple, basic white tank top with denim jeans and just throw on this hat. I love hats. I'll be with hats. How about you? Um, I've never really been a hat girl. I didn't think it looked no. good, uh, you know, in them. But lately, I've been getting more into fashion and like trying things on during these shows and everything. I would like. I've opened myself up a little bit more to it. <laughs> yeah, especially for fall, it's just like an added accessory that looks good. Yeah. Um, especially with like flannel or plaid or just something yeah. that you want basic that you want to throw on and you just want to throw this hat. It's always good to have in case you're in a hat mood, then you can throw it on. <laughs> yeah. Kind of elevates it. Yes. It's a nice accessory that. to have. So cute. We have tons of different hats on the website too. So this is just your classic plain one, but there's a bunch of different ones. Even this kind of crazy blue one. We love oh, that yeah. one on the side too, which would be fun to style. Okay, next up, let's grab this outfit. This is one that I picked out. Um, this one is a super girly look. We just got this cozy cream colored sweater and then this olive green corduroy mini skirt. Super cute. This would be kind of perfect for like maybe a pumpkin patch day. <laughs> yeah, it's perfect for a pumpkin patch day. I was gonna say, like some boots. Um, 100%. Yeah, love it. So let me just show you this sweater, you guys. This is our cozy, cute lattice back sweater. It seems just like your normal, you know, basic sweater, but my favorite part is the back because it's got this lattice lace up detail. Makes it a little bit different. Super fun. It's extremely soft, you guys. Like, kind of insane how nice and thin and soft it is. This is kind of a great, like, Southern California sweater when it doesn't ever get too cold here. You yeah. can't have anything too heavy. This is a really nice thin sweater. So I think I'm going to have to get this one for myself. And then I'm just such a fan of corduroy. Same. And I love this color too. Yeah. Really it's nice. a gorgeous olive green. So perfect for fall. So pretty. And this kind of skirt where it's form hugging, but not like a tight, tight mini skirt. It's kind of like more of that relaxed fit. Mm -hmm. This outfit is just going to really look good on every body type. Be super flattering, don't you think? Yeah. I mean, this is something that you just need to have. You don't realize you need it, but you want to, you need it. Because like you said, in California, you know, it's something you, it's perfect for that kind of weather. Yeah. And if it, maybe you live somewhere where it's a little bit colder, then yeah. you, this could be your base layer and then you could add jackets on top of yeah. it, which is what we're going to talk about next, which is great. So here's the outfit. Um, I would probably pair it with some just flat booties. I think those shoes you're wearing are great too. Yeah. We've got these ones too. These are our Trendy Vibes lace up sock booties. The sock booties are really in style right now. Look at that. We yeah, both picked one up. They're so comfortable. They're like, so comfy. Yeah. They're not going to like rub on you. Um, it's like you're just wearing a sock. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Which is awesome. Mm -hmm. um, these are going to be more of like a bright white. I love the chunkiness and the edginess to these. I think 
that would be super cute. Very cute. I love combat boots. I mean, another just staple. And I've yeah. been seeing more of these white and beige boots. I've always been like a black combat Same. boot girl. I don't even have a very white or brown, but I'm seeing more of the, the, the beige, the bone tones, and yeah. I mean, yeah, that's so, catching my eye. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. definitely like trending right now, you guys. Um, okay, now let's talk about how to style this a little bit differently as well. So my first pick for a jacket is going to be this camo print one, which I think is super fun. So I can even just throw this on like that. Do you want to put the skirt on there? That's super cute. I think the green, the olive green colors match really well. It kind of adds some edginess with it because it's got that camo print. It's a little bit different. I think it ties in really nice. It's like with the greens, um, of course it has the print, so it looks really good together. So cute. And even the buttons are kind of the same color. It's got that like oh, yeah. a dark silver, like gray button color. So it's kind of perfect. <laughs> And with this, I would probably do like a, a black boot. What other shoes might you pair with an outfit like this? I was thinking a black black boot as well, um, maybe an ankle um, or a combat boot, like a black ankle combat boot. Yeah. Um, maybe even a sneaker. I can see a sneaker with this. Okay. Yeah. Um, but yeah, definitely definitely a black boot would yeah. suit this. If it's even colder, again, and you want to throw on some tights, you could do some tights underneath this, like white or a black tight, or some over-the-knee boots so it kind of covers most of your leg and keeps it warm. That's always a great um, move. And we have tons of over-the-knee boots on the site, so go check out that link in our post if you want to see some more of that. So cute. Okay. Um, for another styling option of a jacket, we've got this one right here, the Corduroy Cutie Cropped Sherpa Jacket. Love this one. This one's more of like a, a bomber jacket with the hood, like your classic hoodie type jacket. It's got the corduroy on the outside, so our favorite fabric again. Um, and then the inside is fully lined with this incredibly soft Sherpa, you guys. It's basically like putting on a blanket. I <laughs> going on. Yes, yes, please do. Really Okay, this is really comfortable, you guys. It's, it's I don't know, like I could just touch this all day on because it's very just soft. Yeah, it's kind of insane. I'm yeah. obsessed. I love this. I like that it's cropped too. Yeah, because it's kind of got that like a puffer jacket style because it's thick with the yeah. Sherpa. But since it's cropped, you're not going to get lost in it. It's not too much fabric, you know? Mm. It's a pretty brown too. So cute. So let's put the sweater in here again, hold up the skirt, show the full look. So cute. It's, this is like the fall colors, the yeah. brown and the green. Like you can't get any more perfect for fall than this outfit. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, this is very fall tone. So cute. Very so nice. which is your favorite jacket then? Which one would you probably wear with this look? Do you like the camo or the brown? What do you think, Beatrice? What would you I'm like? thinking... I know it's a hard <laughs> so I think I like this one here. Yeah. Yeah. I think just because the greens, it ties in nicely. Um, I don't know, it just pops a little bit more to me. Yeah. It's a little bit more seamless. Green was one of your favorite colors to start with. I love as we talked about earlier. Yeah. <laughs> so I love that. Let us know down in the comments, you guys, which one is your favorite jacket as well? Which one would you style it with? So cute. Okay, next up. We've got another uh, one of Beatrice's picks, but you guys remember that you can click that link in the post. You can see all of these items and more so you can style your own outfits at windsorstore.com. Okay, next up, let's dive into your second look. Yeah. Um, I just chose, oh, there we go. Thank you. So I went with this very cute knit dress. It's very simple and basic. Um, it's body hugging, it's flattering. I would wear this with this flannel. Um, I just think the colors go so well together. Again, I kind of like the neutrals, the greens, and it just ties in very effortlessly. Um, and I just think this would just go perfect for, for um, I don't know, a girl's, um, a girl's brunch. Um, Maybe even a pumpkin patch as well. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, of course, I would wear it with like a sneaker. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I just love how these two go together. I'm, I, I just, I feel like there's a perfect balance. It's girly, but you still have the oversized flannel. 
Um, and I'm just, I just love basic knit dresses. Um, it's very flattering on my body. Um, and I would probably pair this with, what kind of food would you pair this with? Um, definitely something brown or black you could even do too, or even the ones you're wearing right now. Those are yeah, I would say like this food would look perfect. Maybe even that food right there. If you want to do something a little bit more dressier, I, I like the way these tones just go so well together. This is a pretty brown sand boot color. So just to like elevate it, um, I would wear something like this or a sneaker. Um, yeah. So cute. These shoes are like amazing. These are very sassy shoes, I feel like. <laughs> very sassy. It's <laughs> yeah. really going to elevate your look. And this is perfect. This is a great example of elevating your style with the basics. What would you say your followers like react to the most on Instagram when you post something? Is it kind of showing them how to style different things or is it more lifestyle like you out on a vacation and like what you choose to pack or something like that? I think it's both. Um, you know, you have people who are just like, more traveler type people or people that just need more styling tips and just want to know what what I wear for this occasion um, so or how can I go from day to night um, I think you know it just all depends on the person if they're more lifestyle spirited or just need more styling yeah tips. yeah so. well she's got it all you guys so if you aren't following her yet at Beatrice Adriana underscore on Instagram then you guys need to check her out because look at these outfits that we posted today they're so much fun Okay, uh, next up for the jacket option number two for this dress, I'll treat you and then you can kind of show that one. Yeah, so if, if you want to do something a little bit more elevated or just a little more formal, um, I would probably do this jacket here um, because it just goes so nice together. The tones just automatically go together. Um, it's very effortless and I would style it with that pair of boots there um, because it just completely elevated. We went from the flannel, which is a little bit more casual and just, um, you know, just everyday wear. And then this, which is more, you know, going out, doing something a little bit more formal, the dinner. So cute. Yeah, That's almost like a monochrome brown look, sort of. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So cute. And this jacket is like a very thick faux wool it's jacket. Thick. It's very thick. It's very like heavy, heavy right? <laughs> yeah. So if it is colder or you just want to stay cozy, um, this one's going to be great. It's got that cute little tie in the front so you could cinch in the waist just like yeah. that. Like it's so cute. I love that it has a hoodie in the back too. Love it's that. very cute. Awesome. Okay. Um, next we've got this little bag if you want to throw that on and I think it would look great with this one too. I so I'll just hold it right here too. If you want to switch or whichever okay, one you so want to show. Bag, I this bag here, thank you. This caught my eye. I love this color. It's like an olive green. So cute. And just all these colors are like it just they just all go together. Um, they're all neutrals, like the greens, the olive green, and it just ties in very seamless. So yeah, I think it just I think for both jackets it would look good. Yeah, totally. Yeah. I love that. It's that cute little tiny bag that you just wear on your shoulder that we were talking about earlier that's really trending right now. Yeah. Even that ruching on the strap, so unique, I feel like. Yeah, it's a, it's a nice, um, smooth, vegan leather. So cute. Yeah. Well, I think to top it off with a little accessories, you've got this oh, yeah, pair sorry. of sunglasses if you want to show us how those would look on. What do we think? So cute. <laughs> <laughs> I think they're fun. I would wear these with, um, you know, if you're doing like a daytime outfit, doing brunch, you can just throw these on and you just look put together. And I feel like that's a really unique shape for sunglasses too. Yeah. Kind of geometric, kind of smaller. I love that. Okay, uh, we've got one more look to style for you guys, and this one's a little different, but I'm super excited for it. So, for the last one, I wanted to do an all black monochrome look and kind of do a little bit of a dynamic here with this cropped, cozy sweater and then some faux leather pants. So, this one's going to be our The Casual Crew 
cropped sweater. I love the disrupted hem right here at the bottom and on the collar and even on the sleeve area. This is so in style right now, having a little bit of this disrupted sweater, which kind of just makes it feel lived in, makes it feel super casual, which is great. And then I wanted to pair it with the faux leather pants to kind of dress it up a little bit, right? Yeah, I feel like it's you need to have a faux <laughs> leather pant because yeah. a black leather pant because this is something that's a perfect substitution for, you know, jeans or leggings. Um, they're just nice. They're, they're elevate. They just elevate you. Yes, straight away. And it's gonna so. be super flattering. A little bit sexy if you move the leather. You're just gonna feel ready to go out and have some fun. Yeah, you need a pair of these. Yes, for definitely. Sure. Leather is such a great fabric as well for fall. We talked about corduroy a little bit. Sherpa is obviously great, and mm -hmm. faux leather, vegan leather. That is that other key fabric that you're gonna want to style with a bunch of these different things. You can wear them any ways too. Dressed down, dressed up. Yes, totally. Okay, so let's throw some jackets over this to show how you guys can add some layering elements here. So the first one is going to have this. The first one's going to be our So Sassy Faux Fur Denim Jacket. This one is so unique, definitely a statement piece that we have on the site. If you're a big leopard print fan like both of us, then you're going to need this jacket because it is just so cute. Um, there's a hood in the back that's got all of that a cheetah print on there as well and then the entire inside you guys is lined with this amazingly soft cheetah fabric again like you're wearing a blanket and I love the denim on the outside this also reminds me of like a 90s jacket don't you think it is it has like a vintage um, denim to it which I like yeah I'm um, but this is just so cute like so I cute. would live in this <laughs> Right. Yeah. And I think it's perfect with the all black look because it really just lets the jacket speak for itself. There's nothing really else drawing attention. It's really just that jacket. So super cute. I would probably pair it with the boots you're wearing. It's kind of the perfect beige color yeah. for this right here. Super cute. I love it. Okay, let's grab another jacket and do it a totally different way. So um, next up is going to be this Mad About It plaid button-down shirt. I personally have this one in my wardrobe. I've been wearing it a lot the past few weeks. Um, let's throw this on it too. We have a bunch of plaid flannels like this on the website, but this one is perfect with this all-black look. I love that. It has that burgundy pop of color here. So cute. That is so cute. I feel like this really complements the black color. It just makes it pop more. Yeah, totally. Um, it's a really thin... Uh, flannel yeah. and it's kind of oversized too so like we we're talking about the oversized look and my favorite thing to do with flannels is tie it around my waist to kind of you know break it up and add a little bit more of a casual style with that but you could do so many different things with this so cute okay last one here is kind of similar to the flannel we just looked at but this one's going to be a much thicker bigger jacket. So this is our Falling for Cozy Vibes plaid Sherpa jacket. Um, I'll show you the inside, you guys. Similar to the other Sherpa jacket we looked at, and even the cheetah print one. It's fully lined with this amazingly soft inside Sherpa. And then it's got that plaid material, and it's kind of got a little bit of a longer hem. So if you can look at it like that, it comes down a little bit longer. Super cozy. So this is a great one if it is pretty cold where you are already because this is going to add a lot of warmth to your look and I would probably even pair this maybe with a black heel and dress it up. That is really cute. cute. I feel like this would be more my style. I love this jacket with the black. Yeah. So cute. And then with this, you know, it's kind of your all black look but since the plaid adds some print, some texture to it. It elevates it, just like uh, we were talking about. Yeah. So cute. That's, that's the fun thing about wearing black. Like you can throw really anything um, to just make it pop. Yeah. Seriously. Okay. So cute. Well, I love that. And then here's even a hat. I kind of love the hat with it too. This is our cabbie hat, and this one's really in style. Um, this one's kind of like a super trendy hat. Like I could see you wearing this kind of like on the streets of New York. <laughs> it looks cute on you. Thanks. 
Yeah, this one's great because it's going to have like a two-tone fabric to it. So it's got that faux wool and then the front's going to be this faux leather on the visor part of this. So it's great for this because we've got the faux leather pants kind of mixing the fabrics and textures here. I think that'd be super cute and fun. Okay, so let's put these back. These are our outfits for the day. But I know you have a couple other things from the site that you chose that you love. So yeah. if you want to pull a couple of them, we can talk about as well to just kind of show off a little bit more of your style and some of your favorite picks here at Windsor. If you guys are just tuning in right now, we're talking all about fall layering, mixing and matching things. Basically optimizing your wardrobe for the fall and getting a ton of different outfits and different looks out of just a few pieces, which is very key, um, especially for the colder months when you want, you know, just a couple of those core jackets to really match with a bunch of basic outfits underneath. So, okay, we've got a couple. <laughs> I've got a couple. So, let's see, I'll start with, I can hold whatever you need. Okay, perfect. So, these pants here, caught my eye. Um, I love just like the flannel print. They look like they would make the body look really good. It would like be very flattering. Um, and especially for me, I'm five foot one for reference. Um, so for someone who's a little bit on the shorter side, I feel like this would just make you look taller. Um, anything like with like the you know, bow bottoms, I think it'll just make oh, you look, yeah. it'll make oh, you look yeah. longer. Yeah. Like you have longer legs. So this is very flattering, I feel. Um, but yeah, I just think it's so cute. I would... It is insanely soft, too. Yeah, I just it is very really soft. You can't really tell from the picture on the website what the fabric no, is, right? It almost feels like leggings. Yeah, like exactly. Like it's that comfortable <laughs> and soft. Yes. Um, but yeah, I would style this with maybe the top I have on. Um, something or something basic or a tank top and I would throw a denim jacket over. I think that would look very cute. I love this denim jacket too. It's a great one. And this is an oversized denim jacket. I love that long hem. I feel like that's kind of unique with denim jackets, but that would really um, work great for these colder months when you want some of that more material or you can kind of like style it off the shoulder or something yeah. like that. I think it would be so cute. And I would also wear this with a crop top if you want to go out um, with a nice, uh, like a pump heel. I think that would look very cute uh, with a crop jacket. Uh, but then again, if you want to do something just more laid back, do a denim jacket with a basic white top or something. Yeah, that is so cute. I think the dress that you showed earlier, this one would be really cute under this jacket. Oh yeah, very cute. It's got that brown, it's kind of the perfect length. Super cute. With some boots, you could do heels, pretty much anything. <laughs> and I also love it with this. Actually, there's quite a few, a couple other dresses I feel like this denim jacket could go with. It yeah. could go with um, this uh, flannel dress. It just so looks cute. so good together. Um, it's very fall appropriate. Um, it'll look good with a pair of combat boots or even a sneaker. Um, I just think it's very effortless and of course you don't, sometimes when you're wearing something very body hugging you want to, to throw something oversized to just feel a little bit more comfortable yeah. um, and just a little bit more relaxed or more, the more relaxed look. Um, but yeah I think this is very cute. I could definitely see those with some Converse. I know you wore oh, yeah. some like platform Converse into the <laughs> studio today, which yeah. is so cute. I absolutely love that. Converse are a classic. If you add that platform heel to it, super girly, really Yeah, cute. oh, that was, that's perfect. You just <laughs> nailed it. The Converse with this would just be perfect. So cute. Okay, let's talk about this one because this one is a really unique top and it brings out your edgy side, I feel like. Yeah, <laughs> my holding. Yes. Thank you. So, this top was a little bit more of a bold decision for me because it's just, I mean, not bold, but it's just, um, I love like raw tees. I know I've noticed something about me is I always um, gravitate towards them. And, um, but this is like different in the fact that it's like, just like the shape is a little different. Um, and 
I just think it would be fun with like a pair of denim jeans yeah, like paired with the heel and maybe yeah, that would be perfect. These jeans and this top and a black heel would just be perfect. Oh my gosh, I love um, that. It's just edgy and fun. Um, I don't know, I just think it just goes so well. Um, and you just look very put together with an edge. Yeah, yeah. this yeah. is like a cute girls night out outfit if you're going out for drinks or something yeah. like that. Or a concert. Concert, um, um, perfect one, yeah. Yeah, so cute. I've definitely also been getting into graphic tees a lot more just for um, a casual look. And I love that that one is styled like a corset. Yeah, it's, yeah there you go. Like it's you're styled like about. a corset, so it's a little yeah. different. Um, so I wasn't, you know, but yeah, I'm mean, used to more of the different t-shirts, but I think this is kind of like sexier. Yeah, totally. Um, and just fun for a date night. I absolutely love that. Did you want to talk about this one lastly real quick? Yeah, so this one is a knit dress. It's, oh, I love how it feels. It has like a nice quality feel to it. Um, I would, again, pair this with a denim jacket like this, an oversized denim jacket. It just looks perfect um, together. And then maybe like a Converse sneaker or just like a sneaker or even a boot. Um, and you can really throw anything on with this basic knit dress, like even a flannel jacket or yeah. even this one. So just really any kind of jacket could go with something basic like this. So cute. I love that so much. All right, you guys, let us know down in the comments, which is your favorite of the looks that we've been talking about uh, for the past few minutes. I mean, there's so much you could do with this. We're, you know, taking new pieces, we're grabbing stuff from a closet. It just shows really how much you can mix and match with all of these different looks. So all you have to do is buy a couple pieces and you've got like, you know, three or four outfits to work with. Oh yeah. What would you say is one of your main tips? You know, if someone was asking you, what is like a tip that I can kind of always keep in my arsenal or my mind um, when it comes to fashion and trying to style? Um, outfits. If you're kind of lost, like what, where would you guide people? I would, I would definitely start with the basics. I'm big with basics. Um, just everyday wear. It's always those basics that you realize you need. Um, you know, like something as simple as a basic white t-shirt. I'm like, sometimes I'm like, how do I not have a basic white t-shirt? <laughs> um, but you know, it, start with the basics. You need to have your basics, and you can style those basics many different ways. Um, you slowly start getting, you know, your little bit more bold pieces or your flannel, you'll just realize it'll just go with really anything. So um, having something like this, like a knit dress would be perfect. A nice, you have to have like a, your denim jacket, your leather jacket. Yes. So leather jacket. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, so I would definitely say get some good basics. Awesome. I love that. That is such a good tip. I think that is, that makes it easy for people, right? So if you might be overwhelmed with fashion or trying to find your style, just start with the basics. That's a great tip. I love that. I'm going to keep that in mind. <laughs> I'll take these. Okay. Well, we had so much fun on this Windsor Live today, you guys. That is a wrap for all of this fall layering tips. Beatrice, it was amazing to have you today. Thank you so for much having fun. Me. It's been awesome to hear all your tips, learn how you got started. Again, you guys, uh, follow her at Beatrice Adriana underscore on Instagram. And click that link in this post if you want to see all of her pics from today and more. Um, you can really emulate her style right here by shopping at <laughs> Wednesday Live. Um, thank you guys so much for tuning in, and we'll see you later. Bye. Bye.